In the shimmering heat of ancient Egypt, beneath the unrelenting sun, the pharaoh, God incarnate, sat on his opulent throne. Around him a peculiar scene unfolded, servants, their skin glistening, were smeared with golden honey. This wasn't a bizarre beauty regimen or a religious rite, it was a practical solution to a very common problem, the pesky, relentless fly. To comprehend this unusual practice, one first has to understand the environment of ancient Egypt. The banks of the Nile, while fertile and teeming with life, were also breeding grounds for swarms of flies. These weren't merely annoyances, flies were carriers of diseases and potential health risks. For the pharaoh being surrounded by flies was not only uncomfortable but also unbefitting of his divine status. Honey in the ancient world was a substance of wonder. It was a sweetener, a preservative, a medicinal ingredient, and even a component in embalming mixtures. Its sticky nature was well known and in this context exploited to trap flies, much like contemporary flypaper. Honey's antimicrobial properties also meant that while it trapped flies, it didn't become a breeding ground for more pests. One can imagine young servants standing stoically as they were anointed with honey, understanding their role in ensuring the pharaoh's comfort. This practice underscores the hierarchical society of ancient Egypt, where the well-being and prestige of the pharaoh surpassed all else. While the idea of using human beings as flycatchers might be jarring to modern sensibilities, in the context of ancient Egyptian beliefs and societal structure. It was a reflection of absolute devotion and the lengths the civilization would go to uphold the sanctity and comfort of their ruler. Beyond its practical applications, there's symbolic potency in this act. Honey was often associated with the gods, its golden hue mirrored the sun, an essential deity in Egyptian cosmology. By anointing servants with this divine substance, they were, in a way, making them sacred barriers, intermediaries between the common nuisances of the earthly realm and the pharaoh's godly presence. While the honeyed servants of ancient Egypt represent a mere footnote in the annals of history, they offer profound insight into the complexities and idiosyncrasies of ancient civilizations. This practice illustrates the lengths humans have gone to solve problems, the profound societal hierarchies that have existed, and the deep-seated beliefs that have driven cultures.